Fertility treatment, uh, fertility problems or infertility problems, as mentioned, are multifactorial. They include environmental causes. They involve genetic causes. Um, there's no single gene uh, that is associated with infertility. However, when we say that there are genetic causes, this can be even further divided into chromosomal problems or problems involving genes. When I mention chromosomal problems, we uh, um, all human beings on the planet have 46 chromosomes. Humans that have additional number of chromosomes or missing number of chromosomes, most of the time, these chromosomal abnormalities are not compatible with life. The ones that are compatible with life, they have the names of people next to them, like Downs, like Edwards, like Pateau, in addition to other abnormalities like missing chromosomes, like Turner, like additional chromosomes, like Kleinfelter and others. So, in people who have chromosomal problems, uh, mainly related to something called a translocation or a reciprocal translocation, where part of one chromosome is sitting on the other chromosome, while these individuals have the full set of chromosomes, when it comes to creating a child, they might struggle having fertility, they might struggle getting having a child. And if this unbalanced translocation or this balanced sorry translocation is passed to their children there's a possibility for the fertility issue to be passed on as well there are other gene issues there are lots of genes that might be associated with fertility issues i'm going to mention one of them for instance like the y chromosome deletion if present in men that means it will be transmitted to all boys or to all the sons of that specific couple where boy sons of men suffering from the y chromosome deletion will also have fertility issues